Hey guys, my name's Jamin. Thanks so much for visiting my channel. In this video, I have a Dell Latitude 7480. I'm going to show you how to open it up to access your storage and your memory in case you need to replace it or you want to upgrade it. So first thing to do guys, power down your computer the correct way. Make sure it's off and unplugged from your charger. We're going to flip it over and access your bottom case screws. Now you have three screws here on the left, three on the right, and two near the center. Once you get all those screws out, you're going to take a small flat pry tool. I prefer plastic pry tools because they scratch less than metal. And you're going to go around the computer, around the seam, and pry the bottom case off of the computer. Be sure not to put your pry tool too far in. You could damage some internal components. Keep it on the edge and gently but firmly uh, be patient and go around even if you have to go around a couple times. But once you get that bottom case off, guys, this is what you're looking at for the inside of your computer. One thing that I choose to do, guys, before doing anything inside a computer is I either remove or I unplug my battery. It just makes the computer safer to work on touching things. So the first thing I'll show you is how to unplug this battery. So here's your battery. And because we undid the screws in the bottom case, there are no screws holding in this battery. Those were the bottom case screws. So all that's left to take this up now is to grab this black pull tab on the battery plug right here and pull it straight up and out of the computer that will unplug your battery and your battery can then be removed. So after the battery is removed guys, you're looking at these two RAM ports right here and you're looking at your solid state drive M.2 port right here on the right hand side. In order to get the RAM out guys, there's two spring loaded metal arms on either side of your RAM stick. In order to get the RAM out, you would grab each one of those, put your finger on, on each one and gently pry them apart away from the RAM stick that will release the RAM. Usually the RAM stick will even pop up a little bit and you can slide it out at that point. And to plug the RAM back in, guys, if you notice that there's a longer port and a shorter port on your RAM stick. So you match that up with this and you can't really put it in the wrong way. It, it can only go in one way. As far as your solid state drive, some of you will see it like this. Um, some of you will see a metal shield on top of it if you do see that. You unscrew this screw here on top and you unscrew this screw here on the left. That will release that metal shield. But for those of you that don't have that, you just have this single screw here holding down your M.2 solid state drive right there. So that's how you would get at the solid state drive and the RAM in this computer. If you guys want suggestions on RAM, solid state drives, batteries, other replaceable components for this model computer, as well as any tools or supplies that you may need. There'll be a link above, also below in the description to my Amazon store. That'll show you the various components for this computer, as well as tools and supplies that I use in my shop. Also guys, if you have any uh, questions, check out the FAQs below in the description. It could save you some time getting an answer. Uh, if you do need to leave me a question or comment, please feel free. I do get to those as often as possible. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I look forward to seeing you on my next video.